This is Cha Yen, which is the Thai version of a popular caffeinated drink, commonly known as milk tea, that's loved in many countries across Asia. But over the last year, milk tea has taken on a new meaning as a symbol that brings pro-democracy campaigners together across the region. The Twitter emoji for the Milk Tea Alliance was launched in April as part of a celebration of the Online Alliance's anniversary. It shows different shades of milk tea from Hong Kong, Taiwan and Thailand where democracy activists and social media users formed the informal Online Alliance. The grouping has influenced campaigners both online and on the street where people are fighting for democracy and against authoritarian rules. Uh, most of the prominent activists are either in jail, on trial, or in exile. We're facing the largest authoritarian regime in the world. We never want to feel alone. We want to feel supported. This was one of the scenes of the protests in Hong Kong. The focus has been the fight against China's growing suppression on the city's freedom and also the tightening control over the election. In Taiwan, they have also been struggling with Beijing's growing ambition. We have seen Myanmar's protesters rallying against the junta following a military coup in February. In Thailand, there's protests calling for reform of the country's monarchy. I am now uh, 24 years old, but I, I have experienced the coup d'etat in my lifetime uh, two times. The protesters in Hong Kong, they are fighting for mainstream demands of uh, autonomy, democracy and freedoms. For Hong Kong people, their demands are very humble and simple because uh, they just want uh, the Chinese Communist regime to do whatever they have promised in 1997 in the handover. When you look at the images of this protest, you may find a lot of things that protesters in different regions are sharing their tactics against the police force, their creativity and artwork in the rallies, the way the protesters support each other in different regions, and also how the protesters communicate with each other. Be water, be, be very fluid in terms of tactics, um, changing uh, uh, the spot of protest, um, like a guerrilla strategy. Um, and, and these are tactics that actually is not first emerged in Hong Kong. You could see the um, uh, uh, more their existence from elsewhere. They use masks to disguise themselves. They already know from the internet about Hong Kong, how Hong Kong tactics work, and then they apply. And I think uh, in Thailand, people also use humor a lot to fight. The Milk Tea Alliance started when democracy supporters across Asia tried to push back against pro-Beijing forces online. One Thai celebrity was attacked by pro-China trolls on social media for supposedly not respecting the One China principle. That prompted people from Hong Kong and Taiwan to join Thai netizens to push back with a bunch of online memes. People in the region have been oppressed by their government the suffering of the history by the uh, government or the from intervening from other countries that put people in the suffering. So, beauty means liberty for them. Activists across Asia hope that the multi alliance can become bigger than just a community and that may eventually even change the region's future. Every politics is local. And if uh, the representatives in that region are, are more aware of a shift of um, attitude towards Hong Kong or towards China, that uh, it leads to a much more aggressive China policy or Hong Kong policy, then uh, the politics could change. Until the government have the power to censor the world, the beauty alliance still exists and there will be like the ideal of our common faith, common alliances that we locked in for a very long time. China has so far dismissed the group. Uh, 
，不时就涉华问题发出一些杂音、噪音